Adelaide struggled to score in that third, then the Kings didn't look great. I thought Crocker was supposed to be done. Giddy with the rebound. That's his tenth. Hawks lead it by three. He scored the last six points in the game. Here's Giddy with the spin of the fish. In the post-game press of the other night, look, with no Tyler Harvey, Emmett Nard's got to run the show. Wow. There's two points to his name so far. Calls off the charges on this one. He knew what he was doing. He's got the ball on a string. He's a long way from the basket. Shot clock at three. Oh, my. There it is. Henry telling him he's got time. Little mismatch. Now he's got Wetzel. Little step back from three. The door at Nunawading Stadium. And, and it's at, at two o'clock, too, if you don't mind. After coming home from Hobart in the morning, as Giddy does what Giddy is. Leads back to six. Giddy, little hesitation. Fades away on Bruce. What? And I thought the other thing interesting, too, there, Liam. They're conscious of not just having everything reliant on Tyler Harvey's Sunday Detch. For three. Not having a good one tonight. Giddy, step back for three. That's down. Well, hey, if he's not going to get the ball in the offense, he's just he's camping in the corner right now and yet to move. He pops out now. Giddy makes a nice move. Finishes there. A little bit of a change up there from, from the Bullets for a couple of possessions there into the zone. And, oh, this kid's oh, good. My. This oh, kid is good. Step forward. to be able to have enough room to, so we could get to the corner and knock it down. And... Giddy drops two on them. Take care of that. you just got to check that box and make sure you got your sideline players done. It's Giddy. Oh, my Left goodness. Hand. Fake the, the hand. This is Giddy against Noy. Now confronted by Chris Levick. Wants to fire over the top. And that's the field between these two teams. This is a shootout right now. Well executed plays from both teams. Whether it's with their club or get opportunities with other clubs. The price is going up, Corey. Giddy lays it up with the left. Giddy saw that he was guarded by Pete Lee and took it straight off the big screen Hit from Landau and Isaac Humphrey here. says not today. Paul at the other end. There's Giddy off the pick and roll for Pinder once more. The heart of the Adelaide 36 is with a triple. Last seven points for the Kings. Giddy. All stages of this second quarter. Giddy. Way past the Pinder on the roll. He's able to down in Tassie over New Zealand. Had a good strong run home. We'll see what they can put together. But Adelaide certainly playing. Probably going to say Adelaide. Trying to use the clock here, Adelaide. Johnson. Why not? He says. Why? Well, he's going to be scoreless again. Thing Adele. Big problem for the Illawarra Hawks. Uh, 16 points in the first half of Sunday Ditch. Spin move was delightful. Quick to the source, which is what I did at halftime. He talked about bump to the head in the warm up on the outside court. Again, Pinder with the steal. And Giddy up. Crocker. Good rebound, McVeigh. Hands it up. There it is. And it's a big mountain to climb for the 36ers. Giddy from. Long. He had a big smile about it last week post game with Case. Josh Giddy. Oh, Fabulous. Just thrived on this year as he knows he's going to get more attention, especially with the rosters they put together. But the ability to make that quick decision and quick pass to find guys as Giddy lets a fly answers. Go out, Josh Giddy. Big height difference, but Kiva Sykes definitely has the athleticism edge. Here's Giddy. On one, but before that, they've been running the set and executing. Giddy. Goes back over the Isaac Humphrey. And the call is for more minutes for Josh Giddy. You can understand why. Good things happen when he's got the basketball in his hand like that. Sixes. Brisbane can't throw that thing in the ocean. <laughs> Seven of 26. <laughs> Giddy inside. Beautiful. Lovely feet. Like the Adelaide 36s and a, almost an uncontested layup. Nice move from Giddy though to take it straight at Jared Weeks. Well, that's where he's at his absolute best.